My father won't send us to your school. He said the pupils are a bad influence. Is it true, Brother William? I suppose so. I'm Bruno. Schmoll. Sorry? I'm Schmoll. That's your name. Never heard of anyone called that before. I've never heard of My character's Norman. He's 11 years old and he's sort of like the man of the house because his dad's gone away to war. Um, he's got a couple of siblings. He's got a brother called Vincent and a little sister. Yes, yeah, great. I'm really excited. Is this your first award ceremony or have you been to a few now? I've been to this. I've been to a few, yeah. This is the first time I'm presenting an award. You're presenting an award. Tell us about that. Which one are you presenting? I have no idea. <laughs> um, well, Hugo's an orphan, of course, and but just before his dad died, they're in the process of fixing this automaton, this mechanical figure that writes. Hugo doesn't know whether it's going to be a message from his dad or something else, and he eventually finds some bits and pieces to try and fix it, but he also meets Georges Méliès. At this point, we don't know he's a famous filmmaker, but we know that there's a strange link between Hugo, Georges, Isabel, Georges' goddaughter, and the automaton. So it's sort of a four-way link, and so the story spirals on from there. And then the overall backbone of the story is about old cinema. Um, well, this is Armani Exchange that I'm wearing, which is quite nice. These are your top red carpet style tips that you can share with your fans out there. Um, for me, personally, get your mum to dress you. <laughs> Someone else said Rico gets his mum to help him too.